Hey and welcome, this is Steve from Metaslider. With the Metaslider plugin, you can create a powerful, fast, SEO-optimized slideshow or carousel in just minutes. And I'm going to introduce you to a new feature in Metaslider, which allows you to have control over what slides appear on what screen sizes. If you're using Metaslider, you're now going to see a new mobile tab. This is available for all of the users of Metaslider, and it allows you to control which slides appear on mobile, which on tablets, which on laptops, and which on desktops. This is useful because the best looking slide on a mobile device might not be the best on a very large screen. You may want to use a much larger image on a large screen, for example, and maybe you think you have room for captions. However, on a small device, you may want to hide the caption and you may want to use a smaller, faster loading image. So let's take an example of how this works. We have a picture of some houses by canal with some boats in this example. And I'm going to hide this from large screens. In the top left corner, you'll notice that a little mobile icon has appeared. This indicates that the mobile settings are active. We added this because a couple of people told us they didn't realize that this particular slide was being hidden because of the mobile features. Hopefully this makes it clear. If you see this icon, this means that mobile features are active on this particular slide. So I'm going to save this slideshow and I'm going to grab the short code. I'll go to post, so I'll add a new post. And you can add Metaslide anywhere on your site. I'm just going to use this particular approach as a simple example for this video. I will publish this. I'll see what it looks like on the front of the site. And here we do not have the colorful houses with the boats. You can keep on navigating through here and you're not going to find that particular image. However, I'm on a laptop here making this video. I'm going to go back to the admin area to edit this slideshow. I'll click on the mobile tab and this time I'll reverse the settings. I'm going to hide this on mobile devices. I'll click on save and now I should expect and this particular image to be visible in my slideshow on this laptop. There we go. I'm going to test this out by dragging my browser to a much smaller screen size. I'm going to move this all the way in. And now I'm going to refresh. And what I should see is that this image is going to hide on a much smaller screen size. And there we go. If I go through the slides, I'm not going to see those colorful houses with the boats. It is possible to customize these different widths. If you go into the Metaslider admin area, click on settings and help. And one of the options available to you here is to change the breakpoints. For example, if you change this from 420 to 320, that's going to be the breakpoint for the smaller end of the mobile devices. So whenever you choose this icon, it's going to hide on screen sizes between 320 and 768. At the top end, you can also customize the breakpoint for the desktop or even larger screens. I've changed this to 2440. And now if I go to edit a slide, I'm gonna refresh this screen. And if I go to the mobile tab, you'll see that Metaslider has automatically updated the breakpoints. So the small size now starts from 320 and the large size now goes all the way up to 2440. So at the beginning of this, I mentioned that Metaslider 
is the best and most powerful way to build a WordPress slideshow. The mobile features are one of the many reasons why. This is available in the free version of Metaslider. If you haven't given it a try, head over to wordpress.org and grab your free copy of Metaslider today. Thank <laughs> you.